What's good, man? It's KK. Yo, man, before we get into this, hit that like, hit that subscribe button. Y'all know what to do. So, y'all know, last week, man, Lil Tap Mona, Old Block Parkway Gardens, he had got shot in the chest, man. But through the graces of God, man, he survived and he living and able to tell his story, man. But unfortunately, today, man, about like three or four hours ago, man, two other teenagers got shot in Parkway today, Old Block. And one of them didn't make it. He got shot two times in the chest. He didn't make it. Another one got shot to, in the arm. And the first thing I think when I think of this is that when you ride past Parkway, it's heavily secured like a prison, bro. Everybody that ride past that said it looked like a prison, bro. Prison yard. Bro, it's security in the inside and it's a squad police car, a, a real CPD car outside. So you got the Parkway security and you got the real police outside the gate. You know what I'm saying? And then you got, it's a red zone, bro. So police riding up and down that street all day, bro. I don't even be understanding how these events even able to occur in there. Like, what the what the police call out there for? Decoration? What, they just chilling, eating donuts? You feel me? And we can't just blame the police, bro. You got to blame the people at hand. The people accountable. The people who are in there that's doing it. And whoever else, even the people that's not in there, that's probably coming over there doing it or whatever. But also, the parents, most important, man. If you know you in Parkway, and everybody know, man, when you living over there, that's a stepping stone, bro. Like, let's be all the way real. You know what I'm saying? I live in reality, bro. Like, Parkway is not a place where you go to stay and you live there forever, bro. It's a stepping stone to go to other places. I'm not saying that people that can't afford to go nowhere else, I'm not telling them, oh, yeah, you need to get up. Like, hey, man, it's for you to stack your money. Get right and get on. It's not the best place. We know that. And uh, it's that's, it's affordable for a lot of people. It's, it's a lot of startup careers for younger people too as well. But it's not somewhere you should want to raise your kids at, man. It's one, somewhere where you should get your stuff together and, and get it together fast and get up out of there and move to something a little better. So I wouldn't even allow my kids to hang out in there and get comfortable enough. If y'all going to hang out. Y'all going to hang out inside of here or on the porch or something. I don't care how old you is. You're going to be on the porch like some little kids. I don't care if you is teenagers. Nah, ain't none of that walking to the store, none of that. Y'all want to go to the store, I'll drive y'all to the store. You feel me? But it's sad, man, that these shorties is growing up up in there, bro. You, you got to be a certain way. Peer pressure. Peer pressure from their peers. Other kids peer pressure them to game bang, do whatever. And, and and sometimes you could just get caught up. Sometimes the kids ain't even doing it. You could just get caught up in the other stuff that's the midst of what's going on in there, man. You know what I'm saying? So it's a sad situation, man. Rest, I send my condolences to that shorty that lost his life, man. Rest in peace, man. I send my condolences to the family. And get well soon to the other uh, guy that got shot, man. It's, it's, it's a sad situation, bro. And I hope everybody able to come from up under their situation in there and be able to move to better areas for their children man where they can go to the park and they can sit on their porch and they can go outside bro because that's just not a place to stay bro like you know what i'm saying it's, it's just a startup place where you could get on your feet get your stuff together and get up out of there man it's not nowhere to raise your kids and raise a family bro it's just not you feel me and they trying to secure the area and all that but obviously it's not doing nothing man you got police outside the parkway and the shooting still happening. And you got security inside of Parkway with guns. And they patrolling the area and it's still happening. So I, that right there alone should tell you that it's not safe in there, man. And it's not a place to be. So, yeah, man. Cycle continues, I guess, man. You know, it's, it's, it's crazy, man. But, yeah, man, rest in peace of shorty, though. Y'all make sure y'all leave comments in the comment section. And let me know what y'all think about this situation, man. It's Kid KO. Yeet.